middle-aged guy here with a quick update so i was looking for a surf rod and i did some shopping and i finally decided on getting the uh pen pursuit decided on a nine foot with a kind of fast action um as far as the reel goes i was looking for another tsunami shield but then i remembered i had a reel here at home so i'm just going to use that uh for now anyway so i had a coupon for um dicks i went to the one near my job instead of the one here near my home because i would happen to be closer that day so um went in there found the rod i think the rod was like 89 bucks and they price matched it to 66 69 or whatever it was i found it online which was good um i got in such a hurry because i was on my lunch break that um I had a $20 um, coupon they had given me for my previous purchase. They gave me a $20 uh, Dick's Cash that was good for like a week or for this last week. And it was a paper uh, ticket. And I totally flaked on the fact and forgot that I had $20 on my Dick's account uh, for Dick's Cash from points earned. And that I had an email that gave me $20 off of a $100 purchase or more. So I just slipped my mind totally. So I bought the rod for the 66 uh, 69 68 and then it took the 20 bucks off and the total came out to 50 54 which is this one right here see 50 54 and i went about my day then shortly thereafter as i got to work i remembered the other two coupons and i got kind of upset yeah so then on my way home i stopped at the dicks near my house and i re they gladly returned the rod and let me do the adjustment so i could use the rest of my discounts so um I went to get, um, I was going to get another, I was still going to, I was still hooked on that reel. I just couldn't let it go, but I just, I'm going to use the one I got right now. Just priority, right? So the goal was to get a hundred dollars worth of merchandise and, um, I would have a total of $60 off. So essentially I'm getting a hundred dollars worth of merchandise for 40 bucks. So I bought a bunch of, um, fish bites and I bought some gulp. Just try those out too. I haven't really worked with them too much. And Last time I tried to use Gulp was a few years ago, and they were nothing but hardhead magnets. So I just haven't used them since. But we're going to give it another shot. So I bought some fish bites. I bought some Gulp. Um, several packs of fish bites. And for some reason, my math was just horribly off that day. And I kept going back to ring out. And the girl kept telling me that. Um, the young lady kept telling me that, oh, yeah, you're still, you're still like 30 bucks short. You're still 40 bucks short. So ultimately, I ended up buying mm -hmm. that stuff. And then I bought... Um, a net because I when last time I went to the dike I left my my net there and I remembered I forgot it on the rocks and I turned back like 3.2 seconds later and it was already gone and there was nobody around for miles typical dike anyways so I went ahead and I bought the re, uh, purchased a rod and they price matched it like I said from the um, 89 to the 66 69 this is the second time around and then I bought um, the net which was 26.99 and then I bought the Gulp Alive, the container, um, the shrimp one, um, that smaller bucket. It was like 15, it was on sale for $15 from 20. And then I bought one, two, three, four, five, six bags of fishing strips. And then um, the Gulp Mud Minnows. I'm going to give those a shot to see how they work out when I rig them right. Anyways, total for everything pre tax was 10142 so then I gave her all my coupons and discounts that I have for that day. And my total for that purchase, that's the surf rod, that's all the artificials, that's the new net, and um, the the um, fish bites, all that came out to a grand total of $44.84, which is not bad for a $100 purchase, right? I went ahead and paid for it, and it says total savings at the bottom, of 7829. I don't know if y'all can see that. Let's get closer. Can y'all see that? Anyways, it's on there. 7829, which is really impressive. And then on top of all that, um, I earned some more points for my dick stuff. And um they also gave me a survey to take, which <laughs> with the survey it gives me um ten dollars off any any purchase of fifty dollars or more. So yeah, which is pretty cool. So, um, pretty excited about that. Um, other than that, um, I went fishing this weekend, um, went to the dike, um, went to Skyline. That's a road to run. It's 
perpendicular to the dike? Yeah. And just using some of the, some of that gear that I've gotten, I've talked about everything but the surf ride. I haven't really used a surf ride yet. Um, but it was just like, I was mad at myself. I, I was catching nothing but uh, croaker and sand trout. And I'm, when I mean nothing but, I'm talking like, man, it must have been at least 50. I mean, it was literally pulling them in back to back, back to back. And I was mad because I just should have, I was thinking to myself, I should have just kept them and had me a good old fish, fish right here at the house. And I would have been well with the world, but I didn't. Uh, well, next time. Um, the plan is, I was talking to my father-in-law and he just kind of threw it out there today. He goes, we need to go to the jetty to um, Surfside this weekend. So that looks like that's going to be the plan. We're going to head over there this weekend, probably nice and early, like early, like dark early. Like kick the rooster in the ass and wake him up early um, and get out there and do some fishing Saturday. I Maybe probably Saturday or maybe Sunday. We'll see which one it is. Um, we have a cold front coming in, so hopefully that'll get things moving. And that jetty has produced really good, crazy catches before, like kingfish, ling, snapper. I mean, there's every, everything's out there. So hopefully we'll have a good time. Hopefully we'll be catching some good stuff to bring home to make. Um, but yeah, that's the plan for this weekend. So those are my savings. Um, I actually thought about it the other day, and a friend of mine said, you're, you're like one of those couponing uh, uh, people on on TV and I was like the, the ladies he goes yeah I was like shut up he goes you don't realize that you have put way too much thought into this he goes not he goes not in a bad way but a lot of thought so um I started thinking about it and I was like yeah I've kind of gotten in pretty deep with this so we're just gonna um I don't know I mean they're good deals are good deals you know it's not like I'm breaking the bank or anything um as you can tell I'm in the, my closet. I'm not here because I'm hiding from anybody. Um, well, not this time anyways. It's just that my house is very chaotic with the dogs and everything. And so listen to bring them in, turn in. So anyways, those are the savings. Um, that's my dick shopping experience. It just sounds so horrible when you say that, but whatever. And that's the way it is. Um, this is a middle-aged guy signing off. Thank you for tuning in. And I'll keep you updated on the fish and the diet and workouts this week. The workout's going to be back on it on Monday. Have a good one. Peace.